that Christ may dwell in your hearts by faith, that ye, being rooted and grounded in love, may be able to comprehend with all saints what is the breadth and length and depth and height, and to know the love of Christ which passeth knowledge, that ye might be filled with the fullness of God. Now unto him that is able to do exceedingly above all that we ask or think, according to the power that worketh in him, in us, unto him be glory in the church by Jesus Christ Jesus throughout all ages, world without end. Amen. Uh, that's Ephesians 3, uh, 17 through 21. I just want to do a quick video. Um, you know, I just was sitting here thinking, and I thank God that um, I've had I've had a lot of men of God, a lot of pastors, a lot of people in my life let me down. And uh, you say, well, why do you thank God for that? I thank God for that because it got me to study and to do things and start to look in this book by myself instead of taking people's words for it. Start stop trusting man and trust Jesus Christ and His Word. Uh, God wants to reveal His Word to you, and we have that uh, Romans two five and We have the Bible. Uh, written to us Gentiles today in the age of grace. Get in the book and read. Read it over and over and over again. Ask the Lord to reveal himself to you. You think he won't? He'll show you things in, in his word. He'll show you wondrous things out of his law. Take to, uh, Just take the challenge. Just read. Uh, read three chapters of the Pauline epistles a day, and you'll be done in a month. In 12 months, I don't know how many times you'll be able to read it through. Think about it. Uh, Three chapters a day. Just keep reading and reading and reading over and over and over again until you understand, until you see what uh, what you have in Christ today. My friend, you are accepted in the Beloved. The Lord Jesus Christ died for you. you think about that, accepted in the Beloved. Uh, God said about his own son, the Lord said, this is my Beloved Son, whom I am well pleased. When you are in Christ, you are accepted in the Beloved. Be encouraged today. Get in the Word uh, for yourself, study, go to church, listen to the preacher. Uh, I'm, this, this, this is by no means a, a attack on any preacher in your church or anything like that. Go to church and listen to your preacher and listen to the preaching. But get in the word yourself. Otherwise, you're going to be tossed to and fro by every wind of doctrine. Believe me, I've seen it done. It, it was tried to be done, done to me. And, it's, and the devil would love to have you off track. Get into the word. Let, uh, be rooted and grounded in love. God bless y'all. Love you. Bye.